the morning of August 19, 2022. Rinpoche and all his disciples present in Dhamma City are very busy at this time. To host a large international gathering of the first ever non-sectarian Buddhist Monlam in Europe. It took almost two months to prepare Dharma City to accept over 250 participants. The Chupans, masters of ritual and shrine, had spent several nights without sleep to prepare the required number of different kinds of offerings and tormas. Everyone are now invited to the main hall to begin the monlam. What is the topic of the prayers today? And uh, the topic is for the uh, world peace prayer. And uh, this is like uh, all the Buddhist gathering uh, festival to pray. Maybe we can to be together and to pray uh, to become the more peace, easy, comfortable, happy, everybody. Lasala, by the way, we can make such wishes at home without even coming here. What are the benefits of doing this practice together? Even you are like kind of alone sit at home or some place to pray yourself instead that you come into here to gather gathering praise like very much powerful what is also special about Rinpoche's Sangha is that you can be more than just a guest everyone can learn and follow the tradition of performing Mama as a basis of meditative practice. The time is nearing noon. Everyone rises to invite the blessings of the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas from all directions into our minds and into this world.
the Deki group, a Tibetan community living in Belgium, kindly undertook one of the most difficult tasks during Monlam, providing all 250 participants with a vegetarian meal. The cook was nervous before the meal started, because Rinpoche insisted on preparing a very delicious meal to make everybody happy. This event, at the wish of Pato Rinpoche, is free to all participants. A big white tent, which has become a huge dining hall, miraculously appeared just before the Monlam began. It was offered by Rinpoche himself. All facilities and accommodation, free meals a day, tea and snacks during breaks, prayer text, sound system, free internet and much more were sponsored by Rinpoche, his disciples around the world and the participants themselves, each according to their wishes and abilities. During the afternoon session, practitioners concentrate on the particular prayer. Today, on the second day of Monla, it is the Prajna Paramita Hridaya, the heart of the perfection of wisdom, the most frequently used and practiced text in the entire Mahayana Buddhist tradition. In other days, it was Sancho Monlam, Samantha Bhadra's aspiration to good actions, from the Gandavyuha chapter in the Avatamsaka Sutra, which is also called the King of Prayer of Aspiration. Dear teachers and noble Sangha, please pay attention. I have uh, prayer requests. At the end of the afternoon session, the Sangha dedicates the merits of the practice not only to all sentient beings, but also on individual requests. Anyone can ask the practitioner assembly for a specific mention of their name and prayer by making a connection with the Sangha for any amount of donation, starting with one cent. This also helps practitioners not only to think of abstract sentient beings, but also to train their mind in bodhicitta towards each being individually.
my, my wish is that if we will continue every year to do it, how much is the benefit? I, w I hope, I wish we can do every year to pray. Maybe extend more days. And this is not kind of the to pray and uh, to practice something. And also same time as we can to talk about the uh, uh, different philosophy and different spiritual path and different understanding and uh, sharing the knowledge Islamas and uh, to maybe they can to get different benefit. Therefore, I hope we will continue every year.